Since starting the Gates Foundation in 2000, Microsoft founder Bill Gates and his wife Melinda have given out $45 billion in grants. Their work addresses issues like vaccine delivery, family planning, and emergency response. This morning, the couple released their annual letter highlighting the work and nine things they say they didn't see coming in 2018. I had the chance to talk with Bill Gates this morning. Florida is dealing with a premature birth epidemic. Worldwide, it is the leading cause of death for children younger than five. You all partnered with at home DNA testing company 23andMe to study preterm births and you've made a possible breakthrough. So what did you find and how is this gonna help? What we looked at was who are the women who are more likely to get premature birth? What was different about their genetics? And it looks like this mineral uh, selenium, when you don't have enough of that, uh, that uh, plays a big role. And so we're out in the field testing that idea. Uh, you know, we're bringing a lot of new scientific tools to understand prematurity, uh, which is still a huge tragedy in the United States, but an even worse problem when you get into the poor countries. And so scientists now have the ideas that came to them by looking at that genetic data. Your foundation has also worked really hard to make sure that there is access to vaccines as well, not just in the United States, but worldwide. And I'm curious your thoughts on the anti-vaccine movement, something that's affected your home state of Washington. Yeah, vaccines are pretty miraculous. If you are just careful to make sure your kid gets all the vaccines, they're protected from a dozen diseases the rest of their life. Uh, there's a few like measles and pertussis that if even a small group of kids in a school uh, choose not to be vaccinated, if that disease comes in, it can spread uh, even to a few kids uh, who are vaccinated, but their immune system uh, isn't uh, totally functional. So we have to remind ourselves uh, that, you know, these are proven tools. They've avoided literally millions of deaths and it'd, it'd be tragic if it comes back to the US because of some bad rumor or anti-science type approach. And Bill and Melinda Gates touch on much more in their annual letter with everything from climate change to how toilets can save lives. You can watch more of my interview with Bill Gates on WTSP.com.